please don't cancel me for saying this, but polyester is a great fiber for athletic clothing. No, it's plastic. Plastic doesn't breathe. Do you hate the environment? Yeah, 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 I've heard it all before. I want you to forget just for one minute everything that influencers have taught you and look at this from the perspective of a textile engineer. And to do that, the first thing we need to talk about is the term wicking. I'm sure you've heard of it because just about every single brand out there uses the term wicking when they're promoting their athletic apparel. But all wicking really means is moisture movement. And this is important because the faster a fabric can move that moisture, aka sweat, around, the faster it can dry and leave the wearer feeling cool and comfortable. And guess what? Polyester is really, really, really good at wicking. Now, I'm not saying all athletic clothing should be made in 100% polyester, but I definitely think there should be some blended in, specifically with cotton. Here's why. Cotton is really good at absorbing moisture, so it's gonna absorb all that sweat off of your body. Then the polyester is going to take it and move it and spread it out so it can evaporate faster. This is the perfect combination for the ultimate athletic wear. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Is there a time and a place to use polyester or should it be avoided at all costs?